do get them in, somebody with five years, they want thirty and forty dollars an hour. Yes, they don't sir. want to pay it. Well, we'll pay twenty or twenty-two. But we're not going to pay forty or forty-two. And he said, "Well, what happens is they got too many bad habits." And to some degree, that's the truth. I got. Yeah, I know you, that's, that's a good that's a good thing. You got all this knowledge in some companies, but but the bottom line on the, on the application is the is the, the background. It's oh, guys, be quiet. Go ahead. It's the background on you know, like you go to school and all this knowledge is still. You go, you go. Okay, you go to this person and say, "Well, we got this student here. We got this guy here." But still, we say, "Well, we got this background." Yeah, yeah, but here, here, here's what we can say, Mr. G. Listen, guys, good question. We know that some of us have issues with our background. We can't change that. Don't let that bother you. What I'm saying, what we will do as a school is we can write a reference for what you've done when you were here. Say, this is a different person. Let's listen. This is not the same student. Here's a gentleman now that's got all of his credentials. He spent the time. His grades is good. His attendance is great. Please, guys. So, so that's what we can do. But if they just say, no, we still don't want it, we move on to the next one. So that's why we develop relationships and we ask them up front, do you hire students with felonies? When they say, no, we just can't deal with Well, okay, thank you. Have a good day. We're going to the next one. Our contacts are contacts that work with us with backgrounds. They may say, well, Mr. Roy, we might have some that say, okay, uh, anything over five years, we'll work with them. Anything under, we won't. We keep them over there. We want some that's under that. Some, some guys have stuff that's a year ago, two years. So we try to individually, we'll meet with you and find out exactly, and then we'll try to place you with the companies in that. And we're not going to send you somewhere where they don't want any felonies at all. They'll be wasting your time. We're not going to do that. So we customize companies based on what your needs are. Does that make sense? Yeah, I understand. But the, but that's a lot. But, but you see a lot of that. We search the internet for a job like that. But that's, that's a big thing. Look at the majority of them. It's like the same. A majority of them are the same. They're designed that way to keep mm -hmm. you out of it. You with me? Our job is, is to find the doors that open that will give you enough chance. Let us deal with that. You deal with getting the knowledge and having the two things that I need to work with. Attitude and the aptitude. If you do that, I can do the rest. Listen to me. I've told you guys I've been this 30 plus years. You're not the only student that I've worked with that have had background problems. And you're not going to be the last. It can work, but you've got to believe it. Don't worry about background problems. Well, now, let's get off of the background problems because it's, it's known that people have issues. And that's life. Forget about that. And don't carry it when you walk. That's another problem. And I'm going to tell you to your face, man. you got to shake that negative and get rid of it. Because when you come to me, I don't care about your background. And you know, we talked. Every one of you came through my office first. And I know you. I know what you got and what you don't have. And I don't talk it. But my point is, that does not matter to me. And it does not matter to the employers. And those that it does matter, we don't deal with them. We deal with those where there's some opportunities for you. Okay, we can't hang on that negative. We're not going to progress if we stay negative. We've got to stay positive. Here's what you've got to be able to do. You've got to be able to walk and talk this here. See, once you've got this in the brain, and you walk up to the man, and you can lay this out on him and fix his stuff, then you've got an opportunity. You create your own business. Get off of that negative crap. Leave it in the past. You did it. It happened. That's life. You can't change it. When you can change it, change it. If you can't, leave it alone. No one's perfect. Everybody's done something. Just some got caught, some did. Right? It is what it is. We can't dwell on that. You got to be better than the average. Listen to what I'm telling you. Now, it's your life. And as I told you earlier, and I'm going to say it again, I'll tell the whole group, the school that, if this is too much for you, tap out. When I, you want me to tap out? I've got the hat. Popeyes is hiring. Churches is hiring. And you can tap out. I give you a hat. All I got to do is call, and they'll put you on the chicken shack. Right. 
Listen for the buzzer. Ooh. All you gotta do when the buzzer beep, 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 pull it out, put it on the rack. I mean that. Take off, tap out, tap out. But you're gonna stay with this, stick with something, and finish it. That's right. That's and go right. get your money. That's right. But I, to, to what he was saying, I'm just gonna piggyback on it. Yes, sir. You know, uh, when you got your bills at a certain level, there's certain jobs you can't afford to. Uh, I agree. To take, right? Yes, so sir. You go here and looking for a job, say twenty dollars an hour, and then you have a situation with your background. They might. They might they, start you lower, you know what I mean? They might start you lower. They may not help you at all. That's right. But what you do, Joe, you pack your stuff and go to the next one. Listen, you're in the land of opportunity. You're in Houston, man. Yeah. Listen you're not out in the backwoods somewhere. Listen to what I'm saying now. Yeah. Listen to me. Come on, come on. Listen, you're back on track. Listen to me. You're in Houston, man. Serious. And listen to what I'm saying. Africa, I don't know that out here, man. Come on. Yeah, real talk. This is real. You can name your price, guys, but you got to be serious. For those that are serious, you're going to make it. For those that's not serious, you're not going to make it. I'm just going to be honest with you. you got to be focused and straight up, because that's what these people are looking for. And once you get your knowledge and your confidence up, you're going to walk with that. It's going to be in your body language. If you go in there and just meet the man and, mm -hmm. and you go, there, how you doing? Like this? Job. My name is Tony, you know, like this. They're not going to mess with you. Because they think you like this. You got to be straight up. How you doing, sir? Carl Roy, nice to meet you. This is my credentials, what I can do. Wow, oh, wow, wow, wow. What makes you think I'm the man? I can do it. Let me show you. Can you not use a meter? Yeah, give me your meter. Get the meter, start showing it. What, you got any credentials? Show me your credentials. There you go. Uh, uh, you think you can go out on this call and go out on the call and fix it? Come on back. Yeah, I guess you'll work out. Start come in in the morning. That's how it works. If not, go to the next one. And hey, Mr. Cheese, good question, Mr. Back, good question. If none of that works, start your own business. Yeah, you know what? Talking to me. You know what, Mr. Mr. Roy? Right or wrong? <laughs> Mr. Roy? You got to get with you know what it. what I found out? Yes, sir. They don't ask you no background check when you go get a DBA. Go get a what? My DBA. No, I've, wa I've walked into Montgomery County and done a contract for it with a background. I'm just saying, man, if I, <laughs> listen to me, no one can break my spirit. I've been to the grace of God, I am who I am, because he made me that way. You keep your head focused and stay on track, and you go get it, and stop whining, and let's make it happen. Miss Julie's ready. Yes. Thank you.